G'day everybody and welcome back to Reactive Gaming with Chris and welcome back to Sons of the Forest. Today we're going to be doing a base tour with a subscriber. This is Jay. James is also joining me on the Discord. It was perfect timing. He just logged in so we're going to be doing this together. We're going to have a quick look at this massive, massive looking castle and it's going to look badass. Look at it. Look at the size of this thing. It's cool as. Let me get the boys in. Give me a second. Alrighty. <laughs> g'day Jay. G'day James. How are you going? How are you, mate? G'day, g'day. All right. Let's go check out this big ass castle. Looks sweet. Uh, what's the best way da down, James? Uh, probably just straight from this zip line down. Yep. All right. Let's do that. Did you put on all items? Yeah, mate. I've already done all that sort of stuff just in case. Right, cool. Yeah. Last time that caught me off guard when I didn't do that and I had to climb a rope and I couldn't at third access this place. Yeah. Okay. Might want to keep to the right so you don't get your head chopped off yep. by these things. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look at that. That's cool. Have they ever ventured across here? Uh, at the very early start of the game, yeah. But since I've pretty much done the castle, they haven't really come back. Yeah. yeah. Don't know nice. why. Well, you I got wish on, they would. Yeah, you got on hard survival, so they're bound to come and hit you. What's the yeah. FPS like? Let's check that out real quick as well. Oh, about 38 FPS at the moment looking at the uh, build. That's not bad considering the size of the structure. I'm running a 4080. I'm running a 4080, so it's handling it okay. What's yours, James? Uh, yeah, anyway, move on. <laughs> Sweet. All righty. After you, sir. Yep. So the way. Um, so you got the I might go to the back entrance so we don't get shot. Yep, okay. Hang on, sorry, give me one second. Ready run. <laughs> Just have to turn off the speedy run in the um, super jump, otherwise I'm gonna be speeding all over the place. Kill. Taking the zip line up, nice. Got the elevator going. There's just yeah, a little look at towers with some hey. security. Sorry, Jay, what was that? Uh, just a look, couple of lookout towers with some security. They've got their own rifles and everything up here. Yeah, nice. I love doing these little mannequin things around the place as well. I actually got the idea from James. He was doing it a fair bit. And Tim, too. Yeah. A, lot, a lot of people don't. I never thought about doing it until I seen other people do it. That's a good idea. I'm like, why don't we just have, like, you know, a couple of mannequins up? I wish they would put in the game that you could, like, friend cannibals or something like that, eh? Yeah, just something that sort of gives you a bit of versatility with the game and other yeah, characters. Yeah, 100%. Oh, those mannequins gives you a bit of a... Uh, a bit of variety with what you can do. You can set them up as sort of shopkeeps and everything. Yep, 100%. Yeah. Do you watch uh, Kills for Thrills by any chance? Yeah, no, I've been going through, watching his wall. I probably started halfway through his um, helicopter build, like where the helicopter base is. Yep, nice. Yep. So you saw how he's got the uh, mannequins in the shop front and stuff like that as well, eh? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think good. that's sort of where I got the main the main part of it from. Yep. Um, oh, dropping frames a little bit now. Yeah. Oh, it's to be There's expected. a lot of stone in here. Yeah, man. <laughs> that's cool, though. Um, but this is a two, two level one, so you can jump off halfway, which will take you to the walkways. Yep. Okay. Or if you take it to the very top, there's a lookout. So we'll just probably jump halfway. Halfway. Yep. Try it through the first floor. Ah, there we go. Yep. Alrighty. This thing's huge, man. This would have taken you ages to do. Yeah, I did like ninety nine percent of it by myself. Yeah, I've had a couple of people come in here, throw a couple of stones in, and then walk away. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds about right. Yeah. That sounds about right. Um, it's hard to find good help, isn't it? Luckily, I got James, yeah. Bree, and all that, Tim, and all that to come through and give us a hand. They're always really helpful. Yeah. So you got what's this? Um, your little dining hall. Yeah, a little dining hall. People can come down eat. Yep. Nice. Um. Got plenty of seating up there. We added some mirror rooms underneath yeah. the dining hall, so they're all very much the same. Yeah, that's what I do as well. 
Decorating's like an afterthought for me. It's never the reason I do any builds or anything. I really like just yeah. doing the building, and then after that, I'm like, okay, I'll just slap a um, a fire pit here, bedroom here. You know, I don't. Yeah. It's not my thing. That's more of a Brie thing. She loves to decorate. She's really good at it. So I'll leave that up to her. Yeah. Actually, James is really good at it too. You should see some yeah. of the um, fireplaces that he does. It's pretty amazing. Well, I came up with like the fireplace barrier. I'm not sure I've seen anyone oh, yeah. else do, which is pretty cool. I've oh, never seen that actually. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, definitely. I've never seen that yeah. before. That's a good idea. Can Maybe you still light it from like... there? Yeah. Yeah, nice. Looks quite nice with the sticks in front of it too. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I've never thought to do anything like that. That's why I love coming onto places like this. You always find something new and I always find something to steal. <laughs> Ideas to yeah. steal. <laughs> My mate actually told me to chuck some of the uh, the torches behind these heads. Uh huh. Yep. And it sort of lights them up for you, which is pretty nice too, oh, especially yeah. at night time. Yep, yep. Um, so that's like I don't know, king and queen bedroom. Very big bedroom. Nice, uh, nice main suite. Got a big old. You know, got a rifle and a shotgun. It's always a necessity. Yep. <laughs> This one you'd call, I don't know, the prince's bedroom. Yep, nice. Just following suit with being a castle and all. Ah, uh, yeah, I see what you did. So you put the torches behind the actual um, deer heads. That looks cool. That'll look really nice yeah. during the night time too. It does, yeah. During the night time looks a lot better. Everything looks better in this build when it's in the night time. Like any build, oh, you yeah. know? Chucked a few rugs and overlapped them there. Yeah, sweet. I love that overlap um, thing. I actually learned that from... Um, Third Axis is built. I didn't actually know you could do any of that sort of stuff, and I'm like, I love it now. Yeah. This one's a mirror room from the other one. Like the first master bedroom. Yep. Nice. Um, and then this is my little secret platform level that you wouldn't know about unless oh. you were me, really. Didn't even <laughs> see the rope there, so yeah, you're right. Oh, nice. Damn, you're as bad as me, man. <laughs> You're as bad as me. Like this is the sort of shit that I do. Yeah, I'm a hoarder. Load it up. I'm a hoarder when it comes to this sort of stuff, man. When I played properly before console commands or anything like that, I would go out and restart the game. Go out, restart the game, get all these sort of items. Up all the crates. And yeah, things. man, definitely. Get all the um, just get everything loaded up completely. I had to switch some of these bulbs off because it was absolutely killing my game. Yep. Yeah. I know, right? You should see the waterfall build, man. It's almost, like, terrible. Like, we started turning some lights off and it started making a bit of a difference. They yeah. really, really need to optimize the the lighting in this game, like, big time. Yeah, especially when, like, the lights don't light up too much individually. So exactly. if they wanted to fix it, they can make the bulbs brighter so you don't need so many. Yep. 100%. Um, so you, sort of like a yeah, showcase room. room. Yeah, nice. Yeah, just a showcase nice room. Yeah. Beautiful. One at beach, normal gold. Yep, that's what I like to do as well. Um, and this one's sort of like, you know, if people want to come join the game, help yourself, Whoa. dig in. Oh. <laughs> nice. Oh, <laughs> I love this. This is awesome. And they're back to back too, so they've... There's like, what, 20 of each weapon? Yeah, man. Oh, really? Oh, true. <laughs> I never thought to do anything like this. Like, I thought one was enough, but now this actually looks really good. Yeah, this is cool. Plenty of uh, bone armor for everybody. Want to go out and hunt, whatever they want to do. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Um, oh, I guess we can go to the roof. I've got the uh, small setup up there of some stuff. Yeah, nice. Had to find a way to get up to the roof, and I just sort of fell upon this with a hole in there. <laughs> oh, I've got my UI turned off, so it's really difficult to get up. Oh, there we go. Nice. No one wants to see me um, hungry all the time. Nah. <laughs> oh, yeah, cool. Yeah, this is perfect to do up your um, weapons, too. You'd never get any um, problems up here. Nah, I've... Like I, like, I plated all those weapons down there, yep. and I didn't have anyone attack me because I think I'm too far in the water. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they come to the edge, and that's about it. Yep. Hey, you just oh, play I'm with the... Uh... Yeah, get your rifle out and start picking off one by yep. one. 
Yeah, sometimes I don't even come, to be honest. Like, I'm standing there waiting, ready to go, and nah. nothing. <laughs> I think it's just because I'm too deep in the water. If I was a bit closer to the edge, maybe. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Definitely. They won't, even, they won't even mess with you here. Well, unless nah. it's winter time, then they may. They may. Because of the scale of it, I just did, like, half full, half full to give it that look when you're at a distance away. Yep. Definitely. I love this location too, by the way. This is this is my favorite location. I love it. This is awesome. Yeah, I've seen a few people build here. This is sort of why I started in this spot. Yeah. Okay. You got Calvin there. How do you get stuck up there just walking into a wall? Where there's a Calvin, there's a way. Oh, not really. Not with him. There's no way. He's, <laughs> he's just a... That's another player. <laughs> is it? Yeah. Oh, because I got UI off. I thought it was just Calvin walking into a wall. Oh, that's that's another player. Just randomly <laughs> walking into a wall. <laughs> He's about as switched on as a um as a Calvin then. About as sharp as a bowling ball. That's it. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> he's gone. He was obviously I didn't disconnecting. Like what I said. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, nice. Where to next? Cave. Uh, so we'll go down the bottom floor now. I think we've pretty much covered the top. Yep, nice. You just drop down the holes again. Yep. Uh, where's the other hole? Yeah, one on I'll each end. Way. Is there? Oh, okay. I'll come back this way. Yep. Must be one down here. Oh, yep, cool. Yeah, it's a nice little secret room. I like that. Okay, yep, sorry. This is your shooting range. Yeah. We have two shopkeeps. You can purchase your ammo and some health and... Oh, yeah. him. Um, a full stand with all your different varieties of arrows. Hell yeah. Waiting area if you bring the missus and the kids, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I love how you roleplay this as well, because that's, um, that's the whole thing about this game. Oh, this is way better than my shooting ranges. I wanted something a bit different than just a normal target, so I created, like... Yeah, that's hundred um, percent. I had. That's actually a really good idea. Um, a lot of people are going to be using this now, I reckon. Yeah, for sure. It changes up. Yep, hundred percent. And the shooting range looks awesome too. Got enough spears uh, to last you a while. Like <laughs> many, like bow and arrow pistol. Yep. <laughs> um, How many hours you got in the yeah. game now, dude? Oh, I think. Total, because this is just one server out of a couple that I've played on. I think I've got 50 or something like that in total. Yep. I've played a bit, but I've only been playing since, I think, October last year. Oh, you'd have more than 50 hours then, right? Surely. No, 250. 250. Oh, 250. Yeah, yeah, yeah 250. That, that sounds about right then. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, this one, I think, has been a total of about 30. Okay. Wow. Um, That's pretty quick. I play quick. a couple of hours each night. Yeah. Yeah, I probably play more than I'd like to admit. Like trying I'm to gonna, battle. I'm gonna be quiet then. Yeah. <laughs> James loves the game more than anyone I know. Oh, I'm so keen for the uh the full release. Um, Can't wait to see what yeah. they bring to the game. February really twenty second, man, up. not far. Not yeah. far now. <laughs> know, right? Under a month, under a month. <laughs> I'm really looking um, forward to it. Yeah, nah, it's gonna be great. This is where you sort of come to worship the king. Yep, nice. Sorry, James. You are uh, <laughs> right. you're uh, you're a minion now. Yep. You're you're a peasant. Yep. <laughs> Bow before your king. Hang on, I'm just gonna take me sword sword. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> Get my. Yeah, cool. Hey, this is awesome. Hey, you done a phenomenal job with this. This looks great. That's the front entrance that you don't want to walk through. That's for sure. Yeah, no, you don't you really get, want to walk through there. You get pinged, you go through there. Oh, you definitely end up with a couple of spikes. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, look at this. This is massive. This is the war room. Yeah. This is where all the generals go to sort of gather and decide what they want to do. Your meeting spot, so we're going to be invading what which camp tomorrow. Yeah, exactly. Yep, awesome. Um, and then obviously if any of the generals decide to go against the commander or the, the king, he's got yep. his own little weapons standing by right here ready to take care of him. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> that's cool, man. That's cool. We need we need assault rifles. Assault rifles? 
Yeah. You want an AR, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> I think it'd be a little bit too much for this game. A, a full automatic you don't, you don't weapon. Get too many. You, you normally get anywhere between four and six people at a time. You don't really need an AR. Wow. AR would be nice, don't get me wrong. Oh, yeah. It would be nice as Maybe. a different... That'd be cool if they brought that in as another weapon in the um, patch oh, and then release. Yeah. Oh, or we... even as like what they did in the first one where you find all the components and by the end of the game you can build it. 100%. Yeah. What are your yeah. thoughts on the... Uh, the uh, what do you call it? Um, artifacts that are coming out little by little on the patches. I'm waiting for the last one. I don't know what they do yet. Like the first game it was to obviously deflect and, and attract enemies, but I don't uh, know what they're going to be doing with this one. Yeah, me either. I'm really curious to see what people think. I think it's going to be a weapon um, or, or like a trap or something like that, I believe. I could be completely wrong. Yeah. I really don't know. Just, you know how oh, you saw that picture of it? I don't know if you, when you picked up the picture, you saw the all the components sort of together. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that thing. So that's why I'm thinking I think it might, it might be even a trap. teleport you to that third world that when you go into the final uh, cube thingy and you see the other world, might even teleport you to there and you can. I don't oh, know. dude, I never even thought of that. If, if they can teleport to the other world, they can sort of create two games inside of one, really. Now that would be awesome. Yeah. I don't think they're that good at this, right? Like, surely. They're actually pretty sort of... There's like, what of them, like eight people that work for End Night? Yeah, dude, they've done a really good job with the game, though. Admittedly, it does have its problems, but I, I'm not going to complain well, because... Consider as well, before they started this, they just did like the normal sort of... Like what you'd play on your iPhone, really. True, true. And then, and then they've come out with this, so they've done a really great job. Oh, bro, yeah, 100%. Like, that's what I say. Like, people rag on this game with all the little nitpicky problems and stuff like that. But yeah. you, you, you can't do that. You got to look at the um, the positives to this game, and the positives outweigh the negatives, hundred percent. Like even the graphics, like yeah, go oh, outside, like things. Go outside, o like open world. The you know the nature is beautiful. Everything looks beautiful. Like you can't yeah. compare that to any other game that I've seen. Nah, the weather, even the sound effects through walking, well, snow yeah. and everything. Yeah, exactly. The weather, the seasons, everything like that. I've never seen that before. So yeah, no, nah, they've done a really really good job with this game, and I really love it. Whoa. What was that? Anyone? Did I lose audio I then? I created this to get up on top of the wall. Ooh, oh, that's a good idea. Okay. <laughs> oh, same here. Oh, you got it. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Let's try that again, eh? Uh, oh, yep. There we go. Yeah, mad. Yeah, cool. James, come on up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we could have hours of fun on this map, man. Hours of fun on this. Dude, it's too hot for this. Yeah. All right. We're on the top of the world. Okay. Yeah, man, that looks sweet. That's awesome. You know, it'd be really sure awesome. What? What's that? See from over the edge there. Um, not sure if you can see it from here, but I built a big uh, cylinder tower. I was going to try and use the new blueprint mod to try and stick it on top of the castle because I couldn't really yep. get around power up there doesn't yeah. work with yeah. the original grid yep um but then when i tried the blueprint it, it really didn't really work mm. yeah so it's very pink uh fickle it is damn blueprinting i was yeah. trying i was trying to outrun the spike uh the spike trap <laughs> or the spear trap i failed even yep. with a speedy run, I think even then it still gets me too. True. I've seen cannibals and things get past those. So yeah, which I, is weird, isn't it? Yeah. They get past it, but yeah, I, I tried. didn't work. So what do you got building over there, dude? You got something... Oh, let's see. Um, oh, you got another little place wait. up there as well. As I built the castle, anybody who joins oh. the game, I just let them sort of go around, build their own things. So I've had people like 
build a house. Yeah, nice. Um, but not. There's the round tower that I tried to blueprint, and that didn't really work. Oh, the round tower. Yeah, I saw that in the distance actually before. Yeah, it looks good. If I could have, if I could have blueprinted it, it would have worked out really well. But my blueprinting is not working either. I don't know yeah, why. Yeah, like I can blueprint anything else, but as soon as I do this, it gets rid of everything and just gives me like a cross. Oh, true. Okay. Oh. Right. We were trying to but blueprint nah. a bridge. Um, yep. Like a big skywalk we're trying to do. For some reason, it wouldn't let me place it. I don't know why. Yeah. So you built this as well, did you? Yeah, I built this uh, probably a few days ago. Yeah, right. That's cool. I've seen people like, do it. I've been thinking about doing some round structures. I thought this is really time consuming. Really. Um, if you if you use the the mods, so like you've got no building animation, it's actually quite quick. Oh, okay. Yeah. Can you go inside um, of it though? No, no, I hadn't gotten to that point yet. Yep. Once I blueprinted it and chucked it up there, I was gonna like cut a door into it or something. But yeah. As I said, when I blueprinted it, it didn't really work. So, now it's just a, An ornament? a normal Eiffel Tower. <laughs> Le leading Tower of Pisa, whatever you call it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, looks like a big old silo too. Yeah, or we build a little farmhouse next to it or something. Yeah, so it's sort of fizzed in. Yep, for sure. And that um, other build over there, is that just some random person's build there, is it? Yeah, that was just some random person who came in and wanted to have fun. Yeah, why not, eh? Yeah, so I created this server really so I could meet new people. We can, you know, build together. And yeah, man. <laughs> That's the whole reason we do this, isn't it? Yeah. They didn't do it too bad of a job. I put the electric oh. fence around this, the the bottom yeah. so that obviously the uh, baddies from coming in underneath and taking the base out from underneath them. Ah, oh, true. How does, go for, how does it go for... Do you have to go and fill the, um, the blueprint? What do you mean? Well, nobody can blueprint on another person's. Um, uh, uh, I went, server. I went onto another person's save, and I tried to blueprint a couple of other things, and it, it worked. Um, yeah. But because they had a mega structure that was probably four times the size of what I've got over there. Yeah. Yeah. I just couldn't, I couldn't put it anywhere. <laughs> yeah. You need to put you it on water, on a lake. Yeah. But Exactly right. Yeah. It was just too big for me to put anywhere. Whereas if it was just yeah. a normal, for example, this house here, it yeah. would have been a lot with, easier. With the modded um, uh, building, it's um, better for the FPS. Yeah. Because um, it's instead of having four stone, it's only one stone. Yeah, that's what I noticed with um, Hills. Hills for Thrills when he was doing it yeah. at the trying to build the, yeah. the the stone flooring for his town town center. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah, definitely. Uh, yeah. Like I no, got with this. in my in my, in my infantry I've got a a four by fifty um a four by fifty uh platform. Yep. Ready for a bridge. And um I've also got a couple of um I've got a a uh what do they call it? Um a freestanding roof. With no oh, yep, yep. underneath. Yep. Have yeah. you seen other people? They put the tables down and stack the tables and then build on top yes, of it and remove yes, tables. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Dave, <laughs> Dave O'Shadow was doing that. Yeah. Yep. We are just Dude, talking no, about that the other day. Do that. Yeah. I watch a lot of Sons of the Forest videos. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so do I. <laughs> I love them. So and many, not, so many then, good ones um, out there. And you said you got a little town or something you want to start building over here too, eh? Yeah, so I want to create a town with moats around each sort of thing. Yeah. That little treehouse some random person built as well. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, like pretty much this little house here is what I'll be doing around each piece. Yep. Just a moat with a uh, rope bridge to enter. Um, these are just like little shooting towers. Yeah, nice. I like the roof. You showed me that before. Looks very different. Yeah. Looks very busy. Yeah, no, I've definitely, 
definitely got the work cut out for me. Oh, yes. <laughs> the hardest part sometimes is just laying down all these damn planks, eh? Yeah. Yeah, well, I've jumped on this afternoon and this was all empty. So this is everything Everything here you see is what I've done this afternoon since probably 5 o'clock. Yeah, nice. And what's the time now? 9 o'clock for you? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Bit so of work. Four hours or so and I've done all this. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Definitely time consuming. 100%. Uh, I'm like a drinking. Yep. 100%. But once I get all this sort of done and dusted, I'll get you to come back if you want and yeah. do what you think. 100%, man. We'll be back. Let us know when it's done. You're in the, yeah. you're in the Discord, so whenever you want to um, have a chat, we're always usually on. Yeah, 100%. Or if you need someone to give you a hand with some shit, just give us a yell too. We're always happy to do a little yeah, bit, man. Of, bit of stuff, you know? Why not? Yeah. That's the whole Same point of the, um, yeah, cheers. Just want a bit of a hand. Oh, uh, man, we still got to um, finish off the prison build. Yep. <laughs> I don't know if you saw that one video that I put out so far. Yeah, yeah. That was, um, that was the start of it. We, we were about five episodes in. I just haven't released them yet. I was sort of doubting yeah. whether I should release it or not. I don't know. We've done all the work That's... for it. It's pretty much, like, done. We've just got to do a few little things, like bits and pieces and... Just good food for thought for other players when you release them onto YouTube. Yeah, it's. I'm not happy with them. I'm not happy with the yep. editing that I've done on it. I'm not happy with um, the few things that I've done with those videos. So that's why I'm really unsure if I re I should release them or not. I rushed. Yeah. Them. I rushed them way too much. I'd like to see someone do like a life size scale of Alcatraz. Yeah, oh, that's well, what that's what we're trying to do. Yeah. If you want, yeah. if you want after this, we could quickly we'll jump in if you want. Yeah. Have a quick look and see what you think about it. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. We'll end the video here. Sweet. Thank you very much for showing us your build. It's 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 awesome, man. Really loved it. That's ah, great. All good. It was great having you guys on. Thank you. And Thank you. Um, if you loved um, Jay's video, leave a thumbs up for him. I'm sure he'll appreciate it. And if you could please like and subscribe and leave a comment down below, that would be awesome. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.